I'm telling I'm you right now. Hey, we're doing it's a three way trade. If you get the off lights, what do I get? Bro, bag's not even yours. The bag's not even yours. That's but it's a three-way trade. I can facilitate that trade. But what do I get? Panerai class, Ben the White. I'm getting that regardless. I know, that's, that's for the bag. Watch. That's for the bag. No freaking way, you stupid. I'm going to send us debt here. Um, I'll watch. Yeah, okay. Hey, where is the Brighton? I'm broke, so I don't know. <laughs> it's my thing. Don't, don't grab them. I'm going to look. No, the Brighton, I got it. I just might wear that this weekend. I can give, I can give you a good price on it. I'm yeah, how much do you want for that? 45. 4,500? Yeah. No. I'm just great. I can't no. 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 That's that's good price. No, it's not. Go on the internet. Go give us a little bit. Go fi- no, find really. another one that price. I, I'd like it if it had the metal band on. No, you wouldn't. That's no. <laughs> There's no. Come on. You're no, it's a demo. When I met you, you were running, running a, a sativa. So it's, you know, it wasn't on my freaking right hand. Uh-huh. Bless that bro, legs. <clears throat> Wait, what is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> it's Paso, for all you know. <laughs> Alright. Tanya, Panorama class. Well, where's and, the metal band? Where's the metal band? Honey? It doesn't, this is... But how much are they? Band. This? Yeah. Or a metal band? Yeah. I don't know. So, you, you got to find one under five grand. I will Jack it. it. And then I will buy that. And then you duffel bag. He gets the watch, I get the off white shoes. So you have like off white shoes. Honestly, you know how much that off-white. benefits me? Thank you, Cynthia. Like that literally benefits me? Zero. Like he's literally just spending on that deal. Jacket for your dog. Cynthia's <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> I reckon I live at 3,700. I do. I'm not even going to let you make profits around here. Mate, it's not a profit, uh, it's really not a profit. <laughs> I cannot do this price uh, because I lose money in the end of the day. Uh. <coughs> I'll go 4200 if you get the Super Ocean uh, band on it. Done deal. And I give you the bag. I'll live at 4200 minimum. Just for the watcher and the band. No, I still get the other pieces. No, it's not in the clue there. <laughs> uh, looks like you don't want to. I can around. look. Uh, I can look for the band. That, that that's that's the deal breaker. If you can get the band, I'm willing to talk. But it's looking like you, Jet, would rather walk around airports with the most stylish guy with the Goyad. Right now, I, 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 I do look stylish with that bag. It's yeah, a great it's bag. It's a great bag. It's a great bag. Great I bag. cannot oh, be even oh, right my freaking toe. You, know, guy, a incredible. you just look like one of those poses. Like, uh, yeah, maybe it's too cool for you. Alright, uh, let me do some research. I'll get back to you on that. Just fun. Just fun and banter. We're always talking crap and just bantering. And it's awesome, you know. It, it, doesn't, it doesn't feel like an agent client relationship you know it's like he's really our best mate first so it's cool you know little just away from the sport you know you have kind of a life and and mates and stuff so so yeah we're gonna call in to boutique later brightling boutique uh the deal was mertz wants to buy one of my watches but the deal maker or breaker was uh, he likes one certain brand, uh, band bracelet on the watch that it's not on at the moment. And he said if that bracelet will fit on that watch, he said he'll do it. He'll pull the trigger. But if not, he reckons that's a deal breaker. But I reckon we can we can get him without the bracelet regardless. But we'll see. We'll see. Right now, it, it's literally just testing everything. Strength, mobility, uh, stability, stability, sorry. Um, just going through my shoulder and just pretty much just trying to find a reason like or he's trying to find a reason why he can't tell tell me like hey you're good to go ride just because we're still so early in this shoulder injury on a scale compared to everyone else that's had this injury you know the normal times three months and we're only a month and three weeks out now so basically it's the the final sort of examining uh, before I can get back on the bike so like we had physio session with him Tuesday we worked out a little bit and then he'd go through and treat my shoulder and 
and uh, work on me a bit and that went really well especially with my knee we're probably six months out from my knee also um, that I done last year at the end of August and that's really good so so yeah it's just going through checking everything out and, and making sure we're 100 percent you know or or close to 100 percent fit and strong enough to get back on the bike as far as the shoulder goes you know so we don't do anything stupid slide all the way back until your legs as wide as you can oh. what that does is it locks your low back and so I'm only testing the your bit ribs part of your thoracic spine. See if you can get a bit behind your head, and then just feel your body twist to the right. And what we want to see is if I'm measuring ah, rotation left. See that? See how much far you go right? Yeah. So your ribs and thoracic spine need to rotate more to your left. Okay, enough yeah, side bend. Okay, and just kind of listen to your body. Tell me where you feel stuff. You feel normal? That's great. I mean, your range looks pretty good there. Last time we talked about a little bit of micro instability in your low back, right? Anything on the left hand side, I felt like down here. Okay, that's your low like back. Like that middle kind of like that middle thing that shoots up your back. Okay, that's your low back. Okay, but gotcha. Let me push down. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Arm extended. Thumb is up. Okay, don't let me push. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yeah, rest. Let your arms rest for a second. 30 second rest. The game is it's going to rest now. You just, when you're ready, you're just trying to hold the ball in that position. Just okay. squeeze your shoulder blade. See if you can do it for a minute. Okay. Yeah, so up to a, up to a Y right there. Hold one minute. Oh, I thought it was meant to be. No, I just kind of. Sorry. No, you're fine. It's okay if it's a little bit. No big deal. Get it up, get it up, get it up. There you go, right there, right there, right there. It's almost like if you're on the ground, can you get the ball off the ground? It has to be higher than the level of the table. You know, I'm not your big. Just giving you a little challenge to make it a little bit more. Get a little bit more out of your body. Ten more seconds. Work, baby. Straighten the arm out. Yeah, baby. I know you don't like this one. <laughs> I know, I know it. Okay, you're good. And then, of course, I still want you to do yeah, those all ones. those ones. And you can start adding, if you want, start adding like, and I wouldn't do any more than like, five, I would do like a three pound weight. Okay. And start doing your, remember the T's? Yeah, yeah. Little three pound weights or balls or whatever, do your Y's. You should be able to do kind of 30 pulses. Yeah, sure, sure. And you can even do W's, right? Okay. All that's gonna strengthen that little trap. Back. So it's not leaned off. It's, uh, okay. There, you know? Wicked. Is that good? Yeah, perfect, good the brain? perfect. Yep. Okay, that's it for you guys. Sweet ass, thanks, yeah. dude. Oh, that's tore. Yeah, really cool. We got cleared. Get back on the bike. That's pretty sick. So, uh, just get ready. It's Thursday, so we'll get ready Friday, get all, all the stuff sorted, and then uh, get back on the horse Monday. So that'd be really cool. No, it's, it's freaking awesome. We're a month and a month and three weeks out. So, that's pretty damn, uh, pretty damn good for what injury we had, you know, so. Super stoked. We worked hard to, to be back early and stuff, but like this early, we've been cleared. There's literally nothing that he sees like that is telling him I shouldn't be, be able to ease back into it. So, so yeah, we're super duper happy at the moment. So yeah, I mean, like we were kind of like sort of planning on getting back on the, on the bike shortly, but yeah, I think that was a, a really good surprise, to be honest. Just we weren't expecting it to end like that. It was sort of like, all right, we'll see you next week, you know. So, so yeah, that's, man, freaking, freaking pumped. Like, getting 
get back into it.